I'm Rancho Palos Verde City Manager R. Maranian with an update from the June 4th City Council meeting. The RPV City Council took action on a wide range of issues dealing with the landslide, the updated housing element, a wireless ordinance, the proposed budget, and City Council goals. After hearing residents' concerns, the Council adopted the necessary zoning code amendments to move forward with getting state approval for the City's revised final housing element for 2021 through 2029. RPV must comply with state housing laws that require all California cities to demonstrate every eight years how they can meet housing needs across all income levels. In this sixth cycle from 2021 through 2029, RPV was required to identify 647 potential new housing units. However, the city is not mandated to build these units. Since 2022, RPV has been pushing for state approval. Meanwhile, the council continued to address the state of emergency in the Portuguese Bend Landside Complex area. In an effort to assist residents, the council approved offering financial assistance packages to the Abalone Cove and Klondike Canyon Landside Abatement Districts. The districts represent hundreds of homeowners and the city with property in the Landside Complex. The council determined not to protest increases to the city's assessments as property owners within each district. The accelerated land movement has caused millions of dollars in damages to roads, homes, utility lines, public trails, and the historic Wayfarers Chapel. Plans are moving forward this month to install two emergency hydrographers that will remove water to help slow down the slide. As for future city projects, the Council approved the 2024 through 2025 goals that include 18 projects in six major categories. Those categories encompass public safety, infrastructure, transparency, city property, citizen involvement, and quality of life. The Council also accepted the fiscal year 2024 through 2025 preliminary citywide budget consisting of the general fund, capital improvement program, special revenues, permanent and internal services funds. After reviewing the budget, the Council directed staff to include improvements to certain intersections along Palos Verdes Drive South. The total fiscal year 2024 through 2025 preliminary budget for general fund revenues are $39.4 million. The council plans to adopt the finalized budget at its June 18th meeting. Finally, the city council approved a new wireless telecommunication ordinance for private properties. The primary intent of the code is to make wireless telecommunication facilities reasonably available without impacting views and quality of life. For more details on the ongoing issues, watch the City Council meeting on RPV TV or on the City's website at rpvca.gov. Let's stay connected and remember we are RPV together.